Hey, my name is Matt, and in this video, I'm going to share with you my secrets on how to use my free phrase community templates like a pro. I've created over 25 templates in phrase, shared them all for free with the community. You can go use them yourself, and I spent over 300 hours making them. They were all designed with an SEO focus. I've worked in the SEO industry for nearly a decade. I've used all that knowledge to create templates that are going to write content designed to rank. So you should really check these things out. And each template provides ridiculous output. Now, if you've never used Phrase and you don't even know what I'm talking about, in the description below, there's a link to Phrase. Check it out. Now, this video is specifically about my listicle with paragraphs template. What do you use it for? You use it to write blog posts in as little as five minutes. Five minutes to write a thousand words on point about a particular topic. And when would you use it? It's fantastic for pumping out content. Maybe you have a brand new site, you want to fill it up or you have a bunch of pillar articles and you need some supporting articles, it's good for that too. You name it, this template does it. So you can find it if you go into your document, you click the AI Write section and you click Community. You can find all my templates. They all begin with a bracket, then RT, and then end bracket. You can find all my templates that way or you can type in listicle with to find this particular one. At the time of this video, it's almost been used 11,000 times. 11,000 blog posts have been created with this template. If you haven't used it yet, you're behind the, the pack. You gotta, gotta start using this thing. So let's click it. Got some directions in here. It's really easy to use, but I'm gonna share some insider secrets with you. So it expects a listicle input, and a listicle typically begins with the number. So as an example, five tips to train for a marathon. You wouldn't just put in tips to train for a marathon. You want a number, so five. Now, can you put in more tips? Sure. You can put in whatever number you want, but this template works best with numbers lower than 10. So 10 or lower, you're going to get better output. And the, the reason being is the, the, the higher the number is, the more you're going to get as an output, but the shorter you're going to get for each particular item, almost to the point that you're going to get one sentence under each item number. You don't really want that. This is designed to give you about three paragraphs of output for each item number. So keep it at five. If you want to generate more, you can put a higher number in here, but what's going to happen is you're going to get less output. You'll get less output under each particular heading. I'll explain that in a minute. If you do want a longer listicle, like 25 items, you can merge these things together. You can generate, you can do five generations because the phrase AI is completely unlimited. You do five generations and you just pick and choose different items you want. Again, I'll explain all that in a minute. So you want the number five or six or seven in here. And then it expects a listicle format, five tips, five secrets, five ways, five steps, something like that, something in a listicle format. And it does long tails fairly well. So you could say five tips to train for a marathon in the winter, five tips to train for a marathon in the summer. You go with a long tail, it, it might struggle sometimes, but you're eventually gonna get good output. This does long tails fairly well, but let's just stick with five tips to train for a marathon. And then creativity. My templates are very, very nuanced. You don't want a high creativity for this. Leave the creativity at one. If you set it up here, even at two, you're gonna get bad output. Leave it at creativity one. Then all you gotta do is hit run template. All right, and here's our output. This is really good output. If we go all the way down, it tells you the number of words, 580 words for this. So let's read the intro. Marathons are an amazing feat of endurance and strength. They test your ability to push yourself beyond what you thought was possible, but training for a marathon isn't easy. There are several things you, could, you should consider before you train for a marathon. First, don't train too soon. Training too early can lead to injury. If you're just beginning to exercise, you may not have yet developed muscle memory. This means you won't be able to perform certain exercises correctly without thinking about them first. This lack of muscle memory can cause injuries such as pulled muscles and tendonitis. It's better to wait until you've been exercising regularly for at least six weeks before you begin training for your first marathon. Number two, find a marathon that suits your goals. Set realistic expectations. Uh, stay hydrated. Be patient with yourself. Eat well. Get enough sleep. Uh, take care of yourself. Number 10, have fun. Running a marathon is a great. And then finally, it, it sometimes it just cuts off. And that just happens. The AI, uh, it has a limit. It's not going to write a 5,000 word blog post in, in one go. But this is really good. So we're going to take this. We're just going to paste it into our article right now. Super, super simple, super easy. Now, look, I'm, I clicked load more. So while it's doing this, it's also writing more. Let's just delete this. We'll leave the number 10 in there and we'll take from we're going to steal from this second generation. Awesome. Choose the right race distance. I don't think it talked about that. So we'll just paste this in here right here 
And we got four paragraphs. It talks about ultra marathons. I can't even do one marathon, let alone an ultra. So we got 10 in there. Hey, look, or stay motivated. There we go. Yeah, this is talks about finding a friend. Sweet. So now we have 11. So you see how easy it is. Now we're at 800 words. How long did that take? 60 seconds to write this thing? So you can write a really long, an almost an infinitely long listicle, no problem at all. Super, super simple, super quick. Sometimes the AI, the AI will trail off at the end. It didn't in these two generations. That was really good. But if it does trail off or it cuts off, it did cut off, just delete it. No big deal. This AI is not perfect. I mean, how long would it have to take you to write this by hand? A couple hours? We did it in 60 seconds. A little bit of tweaking is not a big deal. And if you don't like what you get after two generations, maybe the first generation wasn't good, second generation wasn't good, third generation wasn't good, I would stop at that and I would tweak what your, your input is. Either your input is wrong, it's in the wrong format and you need to change the format, or the query itself is bad. The AI, if it can't make those connections in its virtual brain, it can't write about it. If you were to write about five tips to train for a marathon when you're blind and you only have one leg, it's not going to do a good job at that. It's, it's way too much of a long tail. So pick something reasonable and just have fun. You'll be really surprised with what you get. So try stuff out, test stuff out, see what you get. Again, the phrase AI, it's completely unlimited if you get the subscription. So really take it through its paces. Here's the, uh, here's the last one. Oh, and I, I forgot to mention too, we're putting in five tips, but we're getting more than five. That just happens sometimes. The AI is not perfect. So we got five for this one, but over here we got uh, 12. But as you can see, as the numbers go up, the quantity of text that we get within each one is lower. Whereas over here, it really gave us five and like, look, we got four paragraphs for this one. So these are all the tips I know about this particular template that I created. If you have any other questions, stuff I didn't cover in this video, drop them in the comments below. I'd be more than happy to, to share some additional advice or some give you some additional help on this or help you with your particular project. Also, again, link in the description, try phrase out and check the other videos I have out. I'm doing a video series on every one of my templates I've made. I want to give as much value as I can to the community. Until next time, goodbye.